Hi everyone, Matt and Lisa here from Filthy Jeep Adventures. We've got pretty exciting news, as you can see from behind us, we've got Lisa a shorty. Yay! meet Olive. Her name is Olive and I'm so pleased that we are now a two Jeep family so um, it's very exciting for us. It's going to be a very short video and uh, in the spirit of Hoovy from Hoovy's Garage we have bought probably the cheapest JK diesel short wheelbase in Australia and yep she's a bit of a hoopty. She needs a lot of love. Um, the bones are really really good but she's pretty scruffy. Uh, the people we bought it off were amazing. Uh, they were very honest, very upfront about the whole thing. And, um, but it, it's, it's pretty cool. It gives us a bit of a project as well, which is what we're kind of hoping for the channel. So we're hoping to give you all a lot more JK content along with the Gladiator. So I'll give you a quick tour around the car now. So we picked up, um, Olive. picked up Olive, sorry. Picked up Olive from the North Coast. So you've had about two and a bit hours of driving in Olive now since you've got her. What's your first impressions? Look, I wish Olive's previous owner was not a smoker. So I've got a fair bit of work to do to remove the smoke smell from her. Um, but I think Olive and I are going to go on some fantastic adventures together. Um, I'm obviously, you know, I've got some basic four-wheel drive skills because I'm normally the passenger. Probably taking my hands off the wheel is probably the first lesson. And, um, well, not taking your hands off the wheel like that um, is the first lesson not to do. But, um, you know, I just want to improve my own four-wheel drive um, skills and I'd like to do it in Olive. Look, she's pretty bashed around. She's got a few scratches and eventually I will get her painted. Um, Still in the original colour, all wrapped. Um, I actually really like the colour that she is. Yeah, the um, colour's great. But um, she needs some love. But I thought while I, you know, do a few scratchy trails and, um, you know, learn a few things, we might leave her as she is paint wise um, until I get a few more trips under my belt um, and then we'll do her up nicely. I really love these cars. I really love a shorty. Um, I can see myself throwing the mountain bike in the back when we're not out camping. Um, I can see us throwing the swag in the back and doing quick overnight trips. Um, I'm, yeah, I think I'm already deeply in love with Olive. A little bit smitten. A little bit smitten. I think she must have been the sixth car the sixth car we, we've looked at and uh, yeah it'd be sixth or seventh and um, the previous cars have all been uh, not the best like not even worth it and uh, you know people love their cars and they weren't even willing to negotiate um, and we just actually have found a car that's kind of worth um, what we think it's value for money for what we paid for it and what's to be done and what's to be done yeah so there's little things like little cosmetic things like that's a little bit loose and um you know the window button's a little bit sticky um the interior except for the smoke smell is probably the better part of the car yeah yeah, yeah. And mechanically it's good it has got a couple little gremlins we've got to sort out uh which we'll do on the channel but um but mechanically it's quite good well it appears to be quite good it's got a from what we can work out about two inch um iron man lift in it yeah yeah. So it's a bit of a step up. It's it's grubby. It's just typical. It's been used. Uh, not it's not a slight at the previous owner. It's just it is the way. Oh, well, to be fair, it's probably cleaner than most that we looked at, isn't it? Yeah. And look, the previous owner loved this car, so we'll clean her up as best as we can, and off we go on our adventures. Yeah. So we'll definitely be doing a lot more. Uh, short trips, day trips, maybe just single overnights with this. The longer trips will still be in the Gladiator for sure. Yeah. Uh, but this will definitely be a lot of day trips we'll use this. Uh, we've got some plans which we'll go through later. Um, this is just a quick intro just so you guys get to meet Olive. Uh, and like I said we will end up doing um, 
we will end up doing quite a bit with uh, with some mods on her, uh, particularly just to make a suit what we want. Particularly the rear, the back seat will come out, all that sort of stuff. But we'll go through that later. So anyway, that's that's going to be it for today. Hope you enjoyed it, and um, look forward to much more olive. <laughs>